The public rally titled Rata Anurata was held this afternoon, led by National People's Power presidential candidate Anura Kumara Desanayaka. The rally was attended by the national executive members of the NPP, as well as artists and party activists. The time for victory is here. This is our best chance. But what are they doing? They are insulting us. Rani Vikramasinghe has prepared a list of all the assassinations from 1987 and 1988 for a TV program. The person he assigned this task to has warned us about it and asked us to inform the people in advance. So that is what I am doing. The people under him are also with us. The situation is favorable. Recently, something happened. The SIS usually conducts reviews of voter behavior. Last month, however, the review was halted. Why? The majority of SIS officers also support us. They believe it is pointless for these officers to continue. Weak support is useless. We need strong support because we have some crucial decisions to make. Arjun Aloysius is a significant decision. Investigating the criminals is a crucial decision. Bringing the masterminds behind these Sunday attacks to justice is a crucial decision. A weak government cannot make such decisions. There is no point in forming a government that comes into power with a narrow margin. We want a government that represents the majority. That is what the NPP needs. Pakse kuji tegarla Ranil Vikramasinghe berlalu kuda kengil lano. Me ar tajit pemuda asa tau pet kengil lano. Insulting the party, Ranil Vikramasinghe is contesting with a different symbol. On the other hand, Sajid Premadasa is also running. Now think about it. Did you destroy the United National Party that you once loved? The leaders themselves destroyed it. Today the SLFP leaders are shamelessly dividing the party into multiple factions. Speaking of the Poho tour is also pointless. When the party couldn't nominate a candidate from within and a Rajapaksa was proposed, non-Rajapaksa members like Prasanna Ranatunga opposed it. When a non-Rajapaksa was proposed as a candidate, the Rajapaksa family opposed it. Ultimately, the party went through so much turmoil to appoint baby. The leaders of the parties you love didn't just destroy those parties, they also destroyed the people. <laughs> Although Sajid Premadasa claims that his administration will end corruption and malpractices, he is keeping people like Sujiva Sena Singer close to him. You might remember how Sena Singer took a cheque for 3 million rupees from the Mendis company, which is linked to perpetual treasuries, and then appeared before Cope. He is making these statements while surrounded by people like them. Will you not vote for Rishad? Will you not vote for Hakim? Will you not vote for Champika? They are trying to fool the people. If you attempt to give ministerial portfolios to people like that, we could end up with a cabinet of about 80 to 100 ministers, as he needs to please all those who crossed over. If not, we request Sajid Premadasa to publish the agreement signed with all of them for the public to see.